Greetings to all of you. The verse that we are going to read is one which is pointing towards the end. From the book of the prophet Amos chapter 8 verse 11 which goes this way. Behold the days come said the Lord God that I will send a famine in the land not a famine of bread nor a thirst for water but of hearing the words of the lord it's really uh, these days we see that that a lot of preachers and in the youtube we hear a lot of people and there are a lot of whatsapp groups words after words they are pasting and they are forwarding so these are all very great but the true words of the lord jesus christ it's very difficult to hear the purpose and the understanding of the scripture all are being distorted the devil is very much at work one of his major work is to pick the words that has been sown in the heart of the people people are not interested in meditating still they are very much interested in hearing if you go to church what you hear from the pulpit is not edifying and we don't know whether they are preparing to feed the people bible also says god has placed in the church maybe we are only the teachers we see the pastors the pastors means the word comes from the shepherds pastoring but there is no true pastoring in the churches today they are talking only about the tithing and so many other things which is for their financial gain and they even instead of depending on the lord they started depending on the flocks they supposed to feed the flock as to how the word of god and what is the word of god and word of god need to be studied meditated and practiced and then it should be preached but we don't find any such things today we see and you should not correct others and uh, men of god and the correcting as they are misinterpreting as judging each other and the true words of the lord is not coming it is not words but the word of the lord is difficult to hear most of them they don't know the fall and how the judgment began and what is the purpose of the scripture the scripture itself is given it is the predetermined history of mankind jesus our has revealed that part by part we are at the very end so now hearing the word of the lord in the last days is very difficult in the days to come most of them, they don't know about themselves the construction of themselves they have spirit soul and body the soul is the middle aspect and the spirit because god is spirit we supposed to commune with the lord and as spirit was darkened soul also was darkened and they are living with only one life which is the physical life which is otherwise animal life they do not have the true life of god in themselves most of the ministers the servants and as well as the flocks so but god never forsakes all those whom he saved it is one savior who saves and also the true believers are the trophies of gra- grace the trophies of grace given to jesus christ as the gift so every soul true souls are the gift within the body of christ so stay blessed hearing that jesus 
as a high priestly prayer when he prays he says whom thou hast given from this world protect them yes god will protect you in and through his power from the evil which will appear in this world so stay strong in jesus christ and in his word you read meditate study and try to keep the word of god and have the forgiveness of jesus christ time and again day after day and stay holy in the lord and stay blessed because in the days to come the hearing of the word of god the true word of god the true word of god you will not get and this is also one of the end time sign and be prepared for the return of the lord could be at any time in mid heaven that is called the rapture in the most precious name of jesus christ i bless you stay blessed